before we begin this video, I do want to say this. Lead is a very toxic metal. If it is if you get it into your bloodstream, be sure to thoroughly wash your hands after handling any form of lead. Um do not lick, taste or do anything that involves putting lead in your mouth. Make sure that if you're that if you are handling lead with your bare hands like I will be, please, please, please make sure you do not have any open wounds on your hand or anything of that nature. Also, please, 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 if you do try this at home because you want to try your hand at metal casting or anything of that nature, I do recommend lead as the first metal that you start with, or tin. Tin or lead, I do recommend as your first metals to start with metal casting, but lead can be extremely toxic, so please take the necessary precautions. Thank you. Hello, hello, hello. Guten Tag. Здравствуйте. Sorry about this, guys. I just, uh, woke up. <sighs> Excuse me. But, um, yeah. Hi, everyone. Today we are actually going to... We're back at the stove, so that means we're going to be melting things. And today I have here with me some lead fishing lures, or fishing weights, um, or sinkers, I don't know what you call them, I don't fish that much, but, uh, I've already turned up the oven to, like, or the stove to, like, full heat and stuff, because I wanted to show you guys how well these things, like, melt. Lead has a melting point of about 4, or 345 centigrade, um, zinc, which you've seen me melt already with, uh, Pennies and stuff. Uh, it has a melting point of about 410, so these things, uh, lead is a, has a much lower melting point, so it's really good. Uh, or, I, I love it a lot for, like, casting and stuff, so, here, let me actually just show you. Let me just show you how it does. Just watch how quickly it will just start to melt and warp. And then when I start to actually pour it, I have actually found out a new way to refine this. And let me actually turn the fan on because that's... Yeah, so... I just want you guys to just watch. Yep, there it goes, one. And they're just gonna go one by one, start like. Oh, there goes that big one. Or is it just the ones under it? Okay. Well, there goes one, another one. And then there. That big one's gonna be gone soon. Well, both of, both of the big ones are actually gonna be gone soon. And there goes one of them. And, oh, well, it just collapsed. What about the other one? I think that's pretty much melted now, so I found out a new way to actually, you know, without just, you know, tossing this into this little basin of water I have here. Sorry, I'm, it's early in the morning, I'm, I just woke up, so, yeah, I ate breakfast though, the most important meal of the day. So I just gotta wait for this thing to get, this thing right here to get up to temperature. And then, then what I can do is I can pour this into this, and then, yeah, so, actually let me show you how liquidy this stuff is. Uh-oh. Yeah, 
I don't have anything on that, thank God. Alright, so, okay, I can't get too close, so let me just... I cannot focus on it, but... If you'll notice, right? There we go. So basically, this stuff is kind of like, uh... It, it kind of like when it's a liquid, it kind of behaves like mercury a lot. So yeah, I think our other little... Alright. Sorry about that, guys. I'm doing this all one-handed because I'm actually filming this morning. So... Yeah. Off. There we go. And let me just show you how well this stuff pours. So how... Put you back on for just a second. Move the water out of the way. And then let's see if I can. Now just watch how lovely this stuff pours. It pours almost like water. Not the singer, but actually, I'm gonna take this slag. Let me see if I can. There's a little bit of lead right there. Okay, wait. No. Back up. Try and separate that. Okay. Then we can just toss that. That in like that. And by the way, I must say right now that this, yes, this is the type of lead that would poison people, like, because, like, pipes and stuff. So this is that same lead that is so notorious for being toxic lead. Alright, so guys, now what I've done is I've pretty much, that's all the lead slag, if you can focus in, there we go. That's all the lead slag in there, so I'm going to need to clean this whole entire thing out later. But here's the, basically quote-unquote purified lead and I'm going to show you how well it uh, just a liquefies once again and then just how it um, how well it uh, pours I mean if you didn't already get that but I wanted to show you it from a aerial view I guess so yeah that's going to be melt and why is it making it close? Why am I shaking so much? But yeah, I mean, I love lead for this. Oh, there it goes. almost just kind of like mercury in that it's very dense as a metal and it's also very dense as a liquid so I will excuse me I will be right back so I want to show you one thing all right guys so here 
this is a copper penny that, well, it's kind of melted-ish, but, well, actually, no, because you can't melt copper on the stove, but watch when I pour it in water, it sinks straight down. Well, I'm actually going to put you in here for just a second so you can dry off. Watch as it goes into the. Uh, it floats. That copper penny floats on the lead. Well, well there we go. Crap. Alright, so there's a little fun thing for you, and my thing is covered in mud. Alright guys, welcome back. I just wanted to show you this, because I'm going to combine these two in a moment. But this was an old lid thing that I made as well, but look how perfect that is. Oh, I love lead so much. And, do you have a piece of paper anywhere? Thank you. Um, I wanted to show you how, you know how we call, like, pencil lead? lead today. Okay. Watch. This is why we do. See? They actually had real lead in pencils. Oh, yeah. A little fun fact for you. Anyway, let's actually pour this lead off. Oh my gosh, I am very... I have the yawns today. Okay. Okay. All right, guys. Welcome back. Ah, and. Lead's going, or the water's going crazy. So yeah, I'm gonna remelt those two cookies that I showed you into one big kind of muffin sort of thing. But yeah, I'm actually gonna give you a nice close-up view if my camera didn't crack. There we go. Oh, I think it's tilting. Yeah, just watch the lid, just, there it goes. Oh, yeah, that must have been an air bubble. There may be a few of those. Without moving the camera, so, I need a GoPro or something. Well, that one? Oh, crap. Wait, what just happened? There we go. Yeah, guys, if you didn't see that, the lead when I cooled it, focus in on it, just blew out from under it, and we have this big shard of it. Back into its little thing. In there. That's also a little piece I can put in. Holy crap. This is also pretty dense, so. Anyway. 
a moment. Okay. Look at that. Yeah, that just... Blew out. Yeah, that is cool. So anyway, and as you can see, look how perfect that came out like that. But anyway, I think I'm going to leave this episode here. Yeah. I'm going to probably remelt this down and probably hopefully get it a bit more perfect. But yeah, I'm going to leave this episode here, guys. Oh, wait, now you can see it. So yeah, I'm going to leave this episode here, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you very much, and I will see you all in the next video. Ta-ta for now.